I was sleeping, and then I guess they had a barricade or something. So I heard it fall down the steps. So I'm like, uh oh. Then I hear it coming down the steps. So I try to run out the door. She tried to close the door. <laughs> I was like, whoa. <laughs> Ethan is very scared of dogs, clean team. But good morning, happy hump day to everybody. My name is Miles here with Advanced Cleaning Systems. He just got done sweeping off the kitchen area that we're going to be cleaning. This is our first job of the day. We're cleaning some tile in a uh, breakfast area, the little nook. And there's the culprit right there that he's super scared of. <laughs> but let's go inside and have a look at it. The grout lines are pretty dirty. They've had this clean about five years ago. So um, yeah, it's time for it to be cleaned again. Now in this area it looks super dirty. It gets a lot of traffic down in here. But let's look closer to the walls and show you what color it's supposed to be. This lighter tan color right here. So this should be a pretty good clean. I'm expecting this to make good video for you guys. So we're going to go ahead and get it started. We already swept everything off. So we're going to go ahead and pre-treat it and agitate using our CRB. clean team so once Ethan is done with the CRB agitation we're gonna let it dwell for another five minutes as we're pulling in our hoses but as you can see it looks like the floor is kind of slanted right here in this area most of the pretreatment all came right here so um, this is gonna when we record this part right here is gonna be pretty good but we're gonna go ahead and do our detail work and go up under all the stuff the CRB couldn't reach but once we're done with that it should be dwelling for about five to ten minutes and then we'll go ahead and show you the main part of the cleaning. clean team we are done with the cleaning as you can see it all turned out very well we took some after pictures but they look a little weird I'm not sure why it looks kind of orange on the phone so hopefully when I put it in the video it doesn't look like that it looks like it has a little shine to it right now but that's just the sealer yeah, yeah it'll flash off and it'll look like normal tile once it's done but it cleaned up really good okay. did you see it when it was being cleaned yeah I see <laughs> it was pretty dirty thank yeah, you for calling us yeah no worries which video did you see that made you want to use us 
I don't know. I just seen like one of these tile videos. And okay. Similar to all four. Okay. And I seen how you guys are doing it. I'm like, right. Okay. That's like the same type of floor I had. Same color. Same really? issue. All right. So. Well, did we deliver the results you're looking for? I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Wife's happy. I'm happy. All I'm right. Happy. happy wife. Happy life. That's it. Good morning, Clean Team. Miles here with Advanced Cleaning Systems. Thank you guys for watching today's video. Today's video is going to be very special. I was actually going to let this one be the one that I was going to upload on Christmas, but honestly, this rug just stinks way too much to be sitting around at the shop that long. So we're going to go ahead and record it today. Let me go ahead and show you what the rug looks like and give you a little bit of background information on it. So we got a synthetic rug right here. We actually picked this up from a customer a couple days ago. Now the customer isn't paying for this cleaning. So Ethan and I were at a job a couple days ago and uh, we cleaned about 10 area rugs and three rooms of carpet for a total of $666. Now I don't like that number so um, our customer she actually wrote us a check for $667. But we cleaned all those rugs at $1.50 a square foot which came to about $351. You know I'm always thinking about you guys so once we're done with the rugs, I went to the customer and asked her, what did she do with this rug? Because she said she wasn't going to keep it. She said she had already thrown it in the trash. So what I did was went to the trash can, picked it up, and put it in the van, and we came back to the shop. And here it is. So we're going to be cleaning this for free. This rug is for content only, strictly content. I don't think anybody would put any kind of money to having this clean. It's a cheap synthetic rubber backing. I know how much you guys love seeing urine coming out of rugs, so that's what I thought about. And um, I actually just wanted to give myself a challenge, you know, see if I can actually get it clean to how it's supposed to be. And I think it's going to make great video. So we're going to go ahead and clean it today. I'm not even going to run this through the duster or vacuum it because I really do not even want to get my vacuum in this. This is very nasty. It's very sticky. It's like it stinks so bad. I wish you guys could smell it. Alright clean team, we got the rug in the tube of water with the cleaning agent. We got both ends tied. We're going to let this dwell for about an hour. But this right here is essentially the same thing as this tool right here. You know, we like to use this when we're doing more than one rug at a time. But this one is more effective when we're just doing one really bad stinker. It allows us not to use as much cleaning agent or water. So it's a win-win. But look at how yellow the water is already. Man, that is so wild.
sorry clean team we are done with this rug but to be honest with you it was a little bit disappointing i thought it was going to be a lot more satisfying than what it was i'm guessing when i had it in the tube that was all the urine and then we let it out so i don't know what i was expecting to be honest with you i thought once i squeegeed it off that it would be super satisfying and so yellow but all that went down the drain but as you can see the back of it looks a lot better no more pee spots but ethan and i just got done loading up the rug van we got rugs right here and then got some uh, furniture this stuff is going to my uncle so we don't have the plastic wrap on there he's going to put it down on the floor but yeah all this stuff cleaned up really good dad cleaned it when we we're out working but yeah that's the end of the video as you can see the weather is horrible today but i'm about to go out of town ethan's going to deliver that stuff to my uncle and yeah that's the end of the video you got something you want to say what you think about I have, that rug? I have a picture to show, but I can't find it. Oh, huh? uh, what you think about that rug? Oh, that one. Yeah. Uh, I hope it dries up well so I can put it in your living room, like you said. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I'm being dead serious. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a lot dirtier than what it was. Stuff in his face. Clean team. I've noticed that like seventy percent of the people that watch our videos are not subscribed to the channel. So if you care about us subscribe to the channel hit that little button right there at the bottom of the screen subscribe to the channel we expect to have half a million subscribers by new year's day can you do that for us thank you that would be nice half a million would be nice let's see if we can do a clean team uh you don't think that's kind of a stretch no it's totally realistic 70 percent of the people that watch the videos have not hit that button yet it's right down there Hit the button, please, and thank you. <laughs> yeah, you are right. I saw a comment saying that um, this is like the third time they watched a video and they recommend it. And he said, I guess I should subscribe now. So, oh, here it is. Yeah. What? Yeah, I need to show the person that said I was a bandwagon. <laughs> well, I want to mention my mom's name. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> tell them about what you're talking about. Last video at the oh. end, you said, How about them cowboys? Yeah, last video, I said, How about them cowboys? And someone said I was a bandwagon. A bandwagon me. I just start liking the Cowboys this year because they're good. Ethan's a day one. <laughs> day one. I was actually born in Texas too. He takes this very serious. Yeah. So look, this is me in Jerry's world, the billion dollar stadium. I was like, it's 2014. That's for the person that's out the bandwagon. Hold on, let like bring the brightness down or something. I was trying to focus so Look at that. Little old Ethan. In Texas. <laughs> in bandwagon. Can't believe that. That made me mad when I saw that. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Alright, clean team. Thanks for watching today's video once again. Um, like I said, the rug wasn't as bad or as satisfying as I thought. The, the tube, it had a lot of urine in there, but when I squeezed it off, it just wasn't, you know. I guess all the urine came out when I had it in the thing. But it still made a good video, I reckon. Some ASMR. I'm not sure. Maybe I wasted my time doing that, digging in the trash for it. <laughs> Dumpster diving. <laughs> yeah. But nonetheless, I enjoyed doing it. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Thanks for watching once again, and I'll see you in the next one. You really don't say nothing. How do I look this morning? I know I look good. I feel great. This thing's The little dog that looks like a hot dog, I'm not sure what it's called. Um, I think it's a wiener dog. Wiener dog. I don't know. I don't think I cut it long enough. I might be able to tie it. I don't know about that one. That was a waste. Oh boy, this is a little bit harder than I thought. I forgot. Try to get some of the air out of here, man. They ain't rolling on me. Don't go. Try to get some of the air out of here. This thing stink. All right, sorry, bubbles. You gotta go. All right, we're getting somewhere. Let's see if I can tie her up. Ah. <laughs> Busted in one of my shoes. You do like wet feet, so I wouldn't be surprised. Wet foot check. Alright, guys, once we're done with this clean, 
in his drive. He said he want to take it to the house and put it in his living room. Cap. <laughs> He been looking for one, but he just ain't found one that's right. He said this will match everything. Yeah, it was at a customer's, a customer's um house, and they put it in the trash can. Miles digged in the trash can and get it out, so he can clean it and put it I in sure his did. house. I sure did. <laughs> what you do with that rug? <laughs> I need that rug. I need to make a video on it. I got those people that were like seeing that being clean. <laughs> sure did. Ain't no shame in my game, man.